I am back once again. LTO editorial news for November 16, 2011. Now it's time for, of course. is telling to my brothers and sisters out there all over the world LTL Occupy Wall Street News of course what occurred a couple of days ago with the New York Mayor Michael Bloomberg and he takes credit for it takes credit for it like a, a Taliban takes credit for terrorism or al Shabaab or Boko Haram for what he had done to the people of Wall Street Occupy Wall Street in New York in Zuccotti Park as the police raided the park at 1 a.m. in the morning to have the park clean. Here he is, here's the police came and raid and clean all the people of Occupy Wall Street's out of the park and then from there took the tents out and the bad thing what they did the policemen I don't know because they like Roman soldiers back in the biblical days when they went to grab Jesus but anyway they took the people's library, the people's library books that is, they call it the people's library, and then what's happened, they throw it into the sanitation garbage. I'm saying, it does not make sense. Really for Occupy Wall Street, that's their heart and soul to educate themselves. Michael Bloomberg, Mayor Bloomberg that is, he's thinking of Ray Bradbury, way of Fahrenheit 451, where they take the, the firemen take the books and burn them. In this case, he had the policemen. I guess they not educated themselves take the books and throw them into the uh, garbage and have the sanitation workers take it. You know, the sanitations are not smart either. But anyway, the, the situation is, it, it's sad to have none other than Mayor Bloomberg of New York City to do something like this. So he, he can brag about it on his Bloomberg report, sir. You know, this is what I do. You don't come to a private park 
and take over. This is my city. Well, guess what? A court order told Mayor Bloomberg that Occupy Wall Street was able to come back. And then Mayor Bloomberg said, on conditions that they will not pitch a tent. They can stay there 24 7. So that means he wants them freezing cold. Uh, see, that lets you know that America does not have heart. See, the 1% must be dominating the 99%. It's just like, um, I hate to say this, um, the white people in Africa back in the days that dominated the whole continent of Africa and they should be learning how to share but guess what hey you may be mayor now and how many percentage did it take for you to become mayor I think it was more than 50% or close to it. Just think of you trying to be mayor next time or governor. Do you think you're going to have that percentage? I don't think so. You may get the 1% from those 1% and the media. Like Public Enemy said, don't believe the hype or the media in America. So that's why you just gonna get one percent. See the the ninety nine percent America ninety nine I call needs to go ahead and make a stand and not vote. Educate your mind, continue on with the books. LTL supports you. LTL loves you. Because you got to know where you came from and where you've been. Not like Herman Cain. As a matter of fact, he's, he's got so many sexual harassments that he needs to cover his own behind. Because you're not going to get the 1% for the election 2012. But going back to you, Mayor Bloomberg, you can brag about it all you want to, but you can't stop the revolution. LTL will be right back with the equalizer to help out Walls Occupy Wall Street. On the LTL Editorial News, this is it with LTL. Occupy Wall Street!